BC 10 News at 6 starts now. We'll get to that in a moment. We begin, though, with a night of crime across San Diego. Six people injured in four separate shootings across the city. Good evening. I'm Jared Ahrens. One of those shootings happened right across the street from Crown Point Park. Three people shot, including two kids. ABC 10 News reporter Madison Weil is there live. And Madison, you spoke with neighbors. What are they saying about this? Yeah, Jared, we just spoke with neighbors who live right in this alleyway where this shooting happened. I first want to show you what they say happened right behind us. This is Crown Point Park. They say that's where the people involved were coming from before they ran down this alleyway. That's when neighbors say they heard about five gunshots. Now, this was at about 1.30 last night. Neighbors today showing us the physical bullet holes that were in some of the garages in this alley. They say, thankfully, police arrived within minutes, shut down the area and investigated. Some neighbors shared security camera footage with us, showing us police searching the alley. Today we learned that three were wounded, but taken to a hospital by their friends. We're told they are in stable condition tonight. Now, like I said, we've been speaking with several neighbors. One father in particular who lives right here says police came pounding on his door just after this all happened. He says it's part of a concerning trend in the neighborhood. To have two people shot, you know, behind my house and then um, having my kids, you know, this is shocking to me. You know, I, you know, we did, we, this is a very nice neighborhood. Not that that matters, it's a nice neighborhood or a bad neighborhood, but, you know, just a little more concern now. It's like we're having people come through the alleys and steal from us, you know, breaking into yards. As for a suspect or suspects, police have not released that information at this time. They did tell us, however, that they recovered a gun from this scene. As always, anyone with any information is urged to contact SDPD. We're live in Crown Point, Madison Weil, ABC 10 News. Thank you, Madison. Now, as we've mentioned, that shooting.